morning, Trojans. Today's date is January 25th, 2023, and it's a B-Day. I'm Sienna Kelly. And I'm Lucy Campbell. Today's quote is from Bruno Mars, an American pop singer, with popular songs such as Locked Out of Heaven and Grenade. He had this to say, quote, you can't knock on an opportunity's door and not be ready, unquote. Attention students and staff, our Petaluma High School competition cheer team is competing at nationals in Los Angeles this Saturday. They've been working hard all season and hope for another victory for PHS. This would be the third national championship for our cheer team. So if you see any of our cheerleaders on campus this week, wish them luck in the upcoming competition. Hello Trojans. Don't forget there's a fundraiser for the senior class this Saturday at Amy's drive through in Rhodert Park. If you go in and mention the Dine and Donate, then 20% of the proceeds will go to the senior class. The Dine and Donate will run from 10.30 in the morning until 10 p.m. If you order online at amysdrivethru.com, you can use the code Dine and Donate. If you're interested in running for the junior class president or vice president, here's what you'll be expected to do. If you're interested in running for the junior class president or junior class vice president slash treasurer, the job description is as follows. The junior class president is kind of in charge of, well, the winter formal dance is one event that the junior class puts on, so the junior class president's kind of in charge of that. Also, really any fundraising events for the junior class. The main job of the junior class vice president is obviously to fill in for the class president if anything happens, like if he's absent or something like that. Um, the junior class vice president is also the treasurer, so he resides over things like that. The ASB president is kind of in charge of things involving more of the entire student body, whereas the junior class president would be more solely focused on helping out the junior class individually. Um, our roles in planning winter formal is we have to find the spot to do it because we're not sure if we're doing it here or we'll find the location off campus. We're in charge of um, securing snacks and decorations as well. Tomorrow, we'll bring you information about what you can expect if you run to be the sophomore class representatives. If you are interested in running for any of these positions, like an ASV officer or one of the class roles, then plan on going to D1 tomorrow at lunch for an informational meeting. Seniors, the Petaluma Education Foundation has extended the deadline to apply for PES scholarships to January 31st. There are currently 25 scholarships for which nobody has applied. Last year, PEF gave away $200,000 in scholarships, with individual students receiving anywhere from $500 to $1,000 per scholarship. The application is easy and totally worth your time. You can apply at the Petaluma Educational Foundation's website. The Snowball is our winter dance, and it's happening on Saturday, February 25th in the PHS gym. Tickets will go on sale starting February 6th, but if you want to bring a guest from another school, there's a process. Pick up a guest form in D1, and after you fill it out, then you need to turn it into the main office. The process can take a while, so you want to start at ASAP. You need the completed form in order to buy your tickets, so get your form in D1 today. Lumicon is this Saturday. Go check out the Egg Bowl competition between the PHS Varsity Super Smash Brothers team versus Gaucho's Super Smash Brothers team. The match starts at 1 p.m. in the eSports room at Lumicon, which is being held at the Lucchese Community Center. Check it out and support your fellow Trojans. Trojans, ASB wants to know what songs you want played at PHS rallies. Check your PHS email for a Google form and send them your personal favorite songs. I personally would love to play Brazil by Declan McKenna. Speaking of music, the music programs at Petaluma and Casa Grande are very excited to announce the return of the Bingo fundraiser this Saturday. It's the biggest and most important fundraising effort to benefit the two high school music programs in the Petaluma City Schools District. The fundraiser is going to be at Casa Grande High School multi-purpose room this year. Doors open at 5 p.m. and early bird bingo games start at 6.15. They'll have pizza to keep you fueled so you can dominate at bingo, have fun food, and support our music program. It's an awesome way to spend Saturday. If you have any questions, email petalumamusicbingo at gmail.com. Three of our Trojan teams have home games today, and they're all against Sonoma. The boys' soccer team faces off against Sonoma on the soccer field, with the JV game starting at 4 p.m. The varsity soccer team will start at 6 p.m. Boys' basketball takes on the Sonoma team in the PHS gym. JV starts at 5.30, and varsity takes the court at 7 p.m. 
And our Trojan baseball team will face Sonoma on the baseball field starting at 7 p.m. If you see any of our Trojan athletes, be sure to wish them luck. Today's club meetings are... Circle of Friends meets today in the Butterfly Garden at lunch, but if it's raining, they'll be meeting in B1. All are welcome. If you are interested, please contact Hope Carver at hcarver24 at pekk12.org or Kayella Burns at kburns24 at pekk12.org. The Art Club meets today at lunch in F8. If you have any questions, feel free to contact Lily Cruz at lcruz26 at pekk12.org. The Interact Club meets today at lunch in F4. Contact Georgina Morris at gmorris23 at petk12.org with any questions. Interested in music? Then check out the Art of Noise Club meeting today in E2 at lunch. If you want to get more information, email Natalie Francis at mfrancis24 at petk12.org. The BIPOC Club meets today in F4 at lunch. Contact Jaden Gregorio at jgregorio24 at petk12.org with any questions. The Crafts and Art Club is meeting today in E7. You can contact Petra Mazorski if you have any questions at pmazorski25 at pk12.org. Come move it, move it with the dance club today at lunch in the gym. If you need more information, contact Sienna Kelly at skelly25 at pk12.org. That's it for today's program. Stay safe out there, Trojans, and make it a great day! day.